I just need you guys to know one thing. When this video goes up, that man is gonna be embarrassed. So, <laughs> hello. Hi everyone, happy Tuesday. Um, I have a video for you guys that I thought of last week and it was literally just out of nowhere and I was like, it's happening, I have to do it. And it's gonna go up on our anniversary. So, happy anniversary, babe. I'm gonna be reading to you guys mine and Devante's, some, not all, but some of mine and Devante's very, very early on messages between each other. And I know you guys are probably like, okay, what do I wanna hear? What? We don't care about your messages, babe. When I tell you, when I pulled these screenshots up, I'll get into how I found them and whatever later on, but when I pulled these screenshots up and I seen the way, not even only just him, but I seen the way we both spoke to each other, embarrassing. Oh my gosh, I can't. Let's just jump right into it. Oh my God, I was literally gonna say like, if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys smash this video. Like, oh, shut up. Let's just jump right into today's video. I'm so excited. I feel like I'm, I'm, my face is already hurting so much from how much I'm already smiling. <sighs> Two broken nails for chips. Also, I know I look super, super cute. Listen, I've worn this shirt a few times already and I'm not gonna stop wearing it until I get a cute photo in it. So, there's that. What else do I need to tell you before we jump in? Nothing, that's it. Okay guys, let's go. <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? What's up everybody and what's up Fresno? Oh, I'm playing, sorry, sorry, I'm playing. I'm just gonna start off with some of our earliest messages, right? Okay, so actually, let me start off by how I even found these messages. So, I would always screenshot my messages between me and Devante whenever I felt like something he said was cute or something was funny or whatever the hell, right? But they were all on like my old, old phone. Never cared about it. But recently, Juliet was asking for a phone, so I found my old iPhone 5 that I was using when I had first got with Devante. Well, I was using iPhone 6 and then I went to iPhone 5 because my 6 broke. I found that phone. I wanted to erase everything off of it so that way Juliet can do whatever she wants to do on the phone, right? So I get my laptop out and I start transferring all the pictures on there. Baby pictures of Jules, pregnant pictures of me, you know, whatever the hell that's on there. And then I come across very, very early pictures or screenshots of mine and Devante's messages. Baby, it was so not okay. It was, it is so not okay, okay. So that is how I like found the messages and whatever. Now, many of you guys know that me and Devante met on Twitter, right? So I could easily just like scroll all the way back to the beginning of our messages and I could like see all those cringy ass messages. But when me and Devante were like two months together, I believe, um, I deleted the whole message thread. <laughs> I got mad at him for, I don't even know what now, I, I literally don't remember, but I got mad at him for something and I like deleted the whole message thread. I had his name in my bio and I like took it out of my bio and I was like, anyways, we're back in business boys. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm, playing. I'm not playing. <laughs> but later on that day, I started talking to him again and I was like, by the way, um, I deleted all of our messages. But I did find a screenshot of some of the very early on messages and you guys, okay, just listen to this. I said, I can't, I literally can't, okay. I don't know what he said before this because it obviously doesn't show it, but I said, you hella cocky for saying all that. And no, I'm not questioning that, but you are. <laughs> Shut up, ugly. <laughs> then Devante says, well, I'm gonna explain anyways. I'm a hopeless romantic. I believe in horoscopes and capability. Okay, okay, he been about that spirituality life before me, okay? I believe in true love, love at first sight and all that shit. I like to plan, I like to talk about the future, how our wedding will go. Oh wait, there's more, okay. Kids, our whole relationship, 
building together as a team, a lot of girls can't handle that. And like, it's somewhat overwhelming. Girls want that notebook type shit, but when placed in the predicaments where they find one, they can't handle it. Like I mentioned ice skating, that alone should show you how different I am. Red flag, red flag, red flag. Listen, 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 listen. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see, well yeah, you can see, but the date on these messages is 12, 30, 16, 1, in the morning. I met Devonte on December 29th at around 11 o'clock at night. So this is just a couple of hours into me and, me and him first meeting through Twitter. And he's saying all this. Okay, had I met him today and that whole exchange happened, I would have blocked him. I would have blocked him. I'll be honest with you. I would have blocked him, right? But... I didn't, I met him in 2016 when I was 16 and he was 18 and we were just so freaking cute together. And I fell for it. I literally fell head over heels for him. I was talking all types of shit and sent the messages to him, but really I was like, he's so different. Oh my gosh, he's so different. He did mention ice skating, he did. Maybe some of you guys are thinking like, and he said, why are you making this video now? Like, shouldn't you have made it like when you, when you and him had like, you know, the life of his vlogs and everything like that? Yes and no, right? Yes, because obviously we're together, we could have both reacted to it, blah, blah, blah. No, because now it's just my reaction. You don't get to hear his side. He can't defend himself. <laughs> No, but like, I don't know. I just think it's super funny now. And also, it's like, I'm not knocking him, but I'm also not not knocking him, if that makes sense. I was stupid in these messages too, okay? Let's move on. I have a screenshot from like what he looked like during that time, because you guys don't really even really know Devontae during that time. Well, you kind of do, but you guys know him like months after, after me and him are already in a relationship or whatever. That's when we started YouTube, right? But this is a picture of my man when I first met him, y'all. Yeah, mm-hmm, that's me. And I'm gonna stick beside him. And I'm gonna stick beside him. And I have stuck beside him, and now he looks so much more fine. Like, this is Devontae, this is teenager Devontae. You know what I'm saying? That's teenager Devontae. Let me show you guys another picture. That's teenager Devontae, right? Let me show you another one. That's, okay, this is stupid. <laughs> this picture is dumb, why did he? Anyways, this was actually his profile picture when I first started talking to him. But he's just so fine. And now I have like the man version of him. Ugh. Okay, so let's get into some more messages. I have another message. I don't know when this was, how much this was into our relationship. I know it was still the beginning, but like I don't know when because there's no date. But it's a screenshot of our text messages, as you guys can see. And it says, from Devonte, if you're feeling like pretzels one day, then I'm pretzels too. That's an inside joke that I'm not gonna get into. It's not happening. You wanna know why? Because you guys literally would not understand it. Even if I tried my best to explain it to you, you'd be like, huh? I don't even understand it till this day. I don't know, okay? Moving on. We both don't wanna get hurt. I'm just as terrified as you, me. What if I'm not good enough for you? Devonte. If you're not good for me, then I don't know what is. Because after you, I'm never looking again. I'm never gonna look for that connection, for that love. Like it's not even regular love. Like I'm truly obsessed with you. Red flag, wee, 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 wee. Let me tell y'all that I fell for everything. Oh my gosh, but he's, he, honestly, that's a red flag. <laughs> don't tell me you're obsessed with me, babe. What do you mean? But I was eating it up. I was like, yeah. Right? Oh, but I really fell for him and I uh, I love him so much. Even to this day. Like Devontae is honestly, and I'm not even saying this just because like whatever. The nicest man I've ever met, right? Oh my god, me and him are like this with two broken nails. Oh, I just flipped y'all. <laughs> he gets me so well, but I'm not even gonna gush over him right now. Ew, what am I doing? Am I falling back in love? Ew, not me reading these messages today and being like, oh my god. <laughs> Cringe, right? Okay, so this screenshot right here. So this was from our second date together. Wait, was it our second date? Yes, this was from our second date together. He took me to Sakura for the first time. Ah! He messages me while I'm getting ready. And he says, check your porch. 
which I was scared because I was like, um, you're not supposed to pick me up for another two hours, sir. You bet not be sitting on that porch, right? So he texts me and he says, check your porch. I'll text you when I'm gonna pick you up, mamas. <laughs> Hell no. Hell to the no. And then I go outside, he left me like flowers, a card, and I think that was it, but yeah. And that was the first time anybody had ever did anything like that for me. Like I was truly starstruck. Still am to this day. Then he says, don't cry, baby. And I don't know what the hell I said because that's the only screenshot I have of it. But like, let's rewind. Mamas, don't call me mamas. <laughs> okay, if he tried to pull that on me now, like today, like if he tried to be like something, something mamas, I'd be like, immediately you're going to jail. Immediately you're going to jail, don't. Not even because like, I don't think it's cute. Like, I guess it is cute, but like, no, <laughs> don't do that. But at the time I was like, oh my God, he got me mama's, I mean, he got me his little mama, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, it was cute. Next messages. So this was when I started to find out like, okay, he's kind of funny or whatever. This screenshot that I have on my phone, it says it's from March 17th of 2017. So that means we had already been together for like three months. He texts me, I can't really see what the top of it says, but you, I love you, I love you so much more, my princess. Today was perfect, me, dude. How did I get someone like you? Devonte? Craigslist. I mean, was he lying? Was he lying? Other messages, this one is from the same, it's from March, but not the, it's from the 24th. This one says, I don't know what he said, but he said, it says damn good, I swear. And I said, I love you more, baby. And I know, I love it. He says, I'm gonna marry you soon, babe. Watch. What's today say? Today? This was March 24th, 2017. And today's day is September 13th, 2021. That means it's been just almost coming up on five years since you said that to me, Devontae. What did you mean by soon? Like, what is soon in your head? Because soon in my head is like a year, right? When, when we're talking about marriage, I'm thinking a year, maybe even six months, right? It's been almost five years? And you got me sitting here giggling about you from five years ago? And I still got this promise ring on my finger? It's fine, it's fine, whatever. Next messages. I, I don't know, I sent him some emojis and he says, yes, my baby, I do. Ew, shut up, ew. Why did he say my baby? No, ew. I love you, I love our struggle, I love our moments, I love the good times with you, the little arguments, I love you. What the hell, did he just get shit off of Tumblr and just send it straight to me? What is he talking about? <sighs> Y'all know I was eating that shit up when he was sending it to me. I was like, oh my God, he is so cute. Notice how I didn't screenshot my messages back to him. They were probably even more cringy. Another message from him. You're so beautiful, baby. Sometimes I dead ass do look at all the selfies you send me and I think to myself, dude, how the fuck did I get so damn lucky? That one was actually cute. That one was actually cute. That one's not even cringy. You know, that was actually cute. Okay. Making me smile five years later. Oh, okay. So uh, some of you guys might also know this, but when I was first talking to Devonte, like, cause we started talking and we didn't go on our first date until two weeks later. And so for two weeks, I kind of didn't really know what he looked like. Cause again, this was his profile picture during the time that I was talking to him. And on his Twitter account, he had no other pictures up and I hadn't asked for his Instagram until like maybe a week, maybe even more than a week or so into talking to him. So during that time, I was like, hey, can you send me like a video of you? Because I was like, Loki, what if this dude is ugly as hell and I'm gonna be your following for him 
two, day, two days into talking to him. Like, what the heck? And then he sends me this video. And look at him. He's so awkward, but he's cute, whatever. And I remember thinking like, bro, you have to be ugly because why are you putting a whole dog filter over your face? Like, why you got filters all over your face? Like, what's wrong with you? Like, I don't know, I, that was very, very sketch to me. So then, later on that day, I believe it was later on that day, is when he sent me this cute picture that I already showed you guys, but yeah, and then I was like, okay, I'll keep talking to him. He's kind of cute, whatever. Ah, oh my gosh, he is so fun. Anyways, it's our anniversary, the day that you guys are watching this, so go show us some love or whatever. We'll be four years and 30,000 months. I don't know what month it is. It might be like the seventh, eighth, ninth month. I don't even know. But we're still here and honestly those cringy messages i really wanted to share them with you guys not only because like i said they're cringy but they're super funny and i just thought it was so cute to be able to look back because you guys know Devonte's still on the channel but like not really anymore so i thought it'd be fun for you guys to know like who he was before the channel and everything like that also you know what i'm saying we were never just doing it for youtube or whatever and we're still not like he's still amazing off camera and whatever it is and yeah, I just wanted to show you guys how cute we used to be. We, we still are, but we live together now, so it's like, ugh, get away. Um, <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Like I said, it's our anniversary today, so go show us some love. But yeah, you guys, I love you guys, and I will see you guys in another video. I gotta go make some dinner. I gotta go. Bye.